गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी चैप्टर नाइन मेजरमेंट ऑफ लेंथ ओके सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग एनी एक्सरसाइज लेट अस लर्न समथिंग ओपन पेज नंबर 123 एज यू कैन सी हियर इट इज क्लियरली रिटर्न लॉन्ग टाइम बैक पीपल यूज देयर बॉडी पार्ट्स सच एज फिंगर्स फुट हैंड स्पैम पेस फुल आर्म लेंथ कॉल्ड आर्म स्पैम क्यूबिट एटसेट्रा टू मेजर लेंथ एज यू कैन सी इन दिस डायग्राम्स ओके ऑल द थिंग्स आर गिवन अर्लियर डेज इन अर्लियर टाइम्स देर वेर नो मेजरमेंट ओके सो पीपल यूज हैंड स्पैम क्यूबिट फुट लेंथ वेथ फिंगर लेंथ एंड पेस पेस मीन्स स्टेप लेंथ Now see, Rahul and his father were discussing about measurement of length. Rahul and his father were discussing about the measurement of length. Now, Rahul wants to know his height. Now, Rahul wants to know his height. Okay. So his father helped him. He made Rahul to stand against the wall and mark a line. Then Rahul measured his height with his hand span. Now Rahul wanted to know his height, so his father helped him in measuring his height. How? As it is written there, uh, Rahul's father made him to stand against the wall and mark a line. As you can see here clearly, these lines are marked. Okay. After that, Rahul measured his height. With his hand span, okay. Hand span means this one, okay. One, two, like this. One hand span, then two hand span, then three hand span, okay. So Rahul is fourteen hand span tall. So what is the height of Rahul? Rahul is fourteen hand span tall. Now Rahul's father measured Rahul's height with his own hand span. It is eight hand span tall. Now, as you know, Rahul, you can see in this figure, Rahul is a small boy, so his hand spans are also small. So, according to Rahul's hand span, his height is 14 hand span. Okay. Now, his father measured the height with the help of his hand span, and now Rahul's height becomes 8 hand span. Okay. Rahul's height is 14 hand span with his hand, and Eight hand span with his father's hand. Why? Because Rahul's hand is smaller than his father's hand, which is not a correct measurement. These are also called the non-standard units of measuring lengths. So, hand span, cubit, foot length, weight, finger length, and pace. These are the non-standard units of length. as the fingers hands feet and arm length differ from person to person as you all know that these things differ from person to person so for accurate measurement of length we use standard units of length so let us study what are standard units of length open page number 124 now you can see here i have clearly written The standard units of length are centimeter and meter. Centimeters we denote as cm, and meter is denoted by small. Okay. Now come to this scale. Everybody has a scale in his or her home. Okay. So you can see these scales, and you can understand centimeter as well as meter. Now let us see here. As you can see, I have written here zero. That means zero centimeter. This is one, one centimeter. This is two, two centimeter. This is three, and it will go so on. Now, what is the distance between this zero and this one? You can say ten, ten lines. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So it becomes from here to here it becomes one centimeter. Okay. Now again, if you go from one to two, let us count and see. 
वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन एंड टेन सो फ्रॉम हेयर टू हेयर इट इज ऑल्सो वन सेंटीमीटर ओके सो एट योर होम यू कैन यूज द यू कैन टेक द हेल्प ऑफ स्केल एंड यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट सेंटीमीटर ओके नाउ कम अबाउट मीटर एज आई हैव टोल्ड यू दिस इज यूज फॉर मेजरिंग स्मॉल लेंस एंड दिस इज यूज फॉर मेजरिंग बिगर लेंस ओके सो नाउ सी इफ सपोज दैट द क्वेश्चन इज आस्ट वन मीटर इक्वल्स टू हाउ मच देन यू कैन से वन मीटर इक्वल्स टू वन हंड्रेड सेंटीमीटर ओके और यू कैन ऑल्सो राइट वन हंड्रेड सेंटीमीटर इक्वल्स टू वन मीटर ओके सो दीज आर द स्टैंडर्ड यूनिट ऑफ लेंथ वन इज सेंटीमीटर दैट इज सी एम नेक्स्ट इज मीटर दैट इज एम सो बाई यूजिंग दीज स्टैंडर्ड यूनिट यू कैन मेजर द लेंथ ऑफ एनी ऑब्जेक्ट ओके नाउ let us see one more thing to measure length in meter we make use of the measuring tape or meter scale for example if we want to know the length of uh, a longer thing okay so we have to use the bigger unit that is meter so how can we measure anything with the help of this standard unit we have to take a measuring tap or meter scale because if we use simple scale we cannot measure a long length okay now relation between m and cm that is meter and centimeter i have explained you here also 1 meter equals to 100 cm but for example if question is asked 5 meter equals to how much then what will you write you can simply write we know 1 meter equals to 100 cm so 5 meter equals to 5 in 100 cm our answer becomes 500 cm okay so students in this way you can convert meter into cm now let us move to exercise 9.1 